Assalamu alaikum and hello guys. So I'm going to tell you my river story. My name is Camilla and I am born and raised in Sweden and I reverted 2015. So I have been a Muslim for almost nine years now. Alhamdulillah, I'm so grateful. Before I reverted, I was a Christian. I did believe in God. So I have always believed in God like for as so long as I can remember. And my family is Christians, but they don't really practice the religion. So I did grow up with going to church sometimes, you know, when it was something special. For me, Islam was like um, an Arabic religion, and uh, I didn't think much about it until I saw like a lot of it on the media. You know, in 2014-15, there's a lot of like negative stuff about Islam in media. So when I saw it, I was like, no, I don't really believe that. I don't believe like that the religion can be this bad. So one day I was talking to a friend and we was talking about like everything and um, from nowhere she was just starting to talk about religion and she's a Catholic and uh, she still is today and um, she's not a Muslim <laughs> by the way. She has told me like Islam is uh, one of the Abrahamic religions and I remember I was so shocked I was like I didn't realize that Islam was one of the Abrahamic religions. So as a Christian, I was thinking like, I need to learn about this religion because it comes from the same place, you know? So I started to read the Quran and uh, I remember I read it from like start to end in like, uh, I don't know, maybe two, three weeks. And I remember when I read it, I felt like so calm. I read it in Swedish, by the way. But I felt so calm and this feeling is so hard to explain but it feels like yeah, like everything gets off your shoulders. It really felt so relaxed in my soul like I had come home, you know? I think all rivers can relate to this feeling. I just knew in my heart when I read the Quran, I knew that this is the right way. And I also remember during this period when I started to read the Quran that I was having like... I remember one time, I don't know if I was dreaming or like something like I heard like someone reciting the Quran in my ear and uh, at the time I didn't know it was the Quran. I remember this dream so like strongly, like someone was reciting something in my ear and after when I heard the Quran I was like it's the same. It's the same that I heard like in my dream. So I really felt like it came from Allah. He's showing me this way that uh, I'm on the right way. My life before Islam, it was pretty normal. Like it was, I feel like I was like living in my bubble. And uh, and yeah, I would say that I lost a lot of friends after converting to Islam and uh, had a lot of family members that were against it. And uh, some of them are still today. They don't like it, but it's okay. Like most of them accept it. And it's not like a big deal anymore. Alhamdulillah, I'm really so grateful that I'm a Muslim and I wouldn't change it for like anything in the world. So yeah, that's my river story and I hope that you liked it. This lady, she was born in a Christian family, but her family members were not that religious. She used to go to the church, but after seeing so many negative news about Islam in the media, she wanted to research about Islam. And one of our friends said that Islam is Abrahamic religion, which is like the religion that the Christianity and all other religions that evolved from that religion, she used to know like that. So she said that so Islam should be similar religion like Christianity as it is an Abrahamic religion. So she wanted to learn more about Islam. And one day she heard the recitation of the Quran in her dream and when she woke up later when she heard the recitation of the quran she found that it is the similar uh, recitation and she thought that this is a sign from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for her to convert to islam so she later reverted to islam alhamdulillah such a beautiful way of accepting islam sometimes you know we get really frustrated we get really sad when we hear the all the bad news and negative news about the muslims about islam they plan and allah has a plan allah is the best of planners even with their negative marketing 
people are getting to know about Islam and they are finding out the beauty of Islam and finally reverting to Islam. Today, all over the world, from Asia to Europe to Africa, you name it, Islam has become one of the fastest growing religion. Alhamdulillah. So my dear brothers and sisters, share the message of Islam both online and offline. Do dawa work. Be nice to people. Show your good character and conduct. And if anyone accepts Islam through your dawa, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will reward you immensely. And Allah says in the Quran, doing dawa is one of the best work that you can do. And whenever you do dawa, do it with wisdom and with best of teachings and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will make it easy for you.